come along with me. I'm gonna make a great summer salad with peaches and goat cheese. These are all the ingredients you're gonna need. Check out the link in bio for the exact recipe. First, you have to wash your hands, of course, with our beautiful hand soap. Next, don't forget to rinse your produce. It's really important to do that. I love using different colored tomatoes. I think they just bring such um, brightness and summer feeling to my salad, but you can use whatever you want. This is my spinach. Okay, now you chop up your onion. Don't give me any hate. I'm not a chef. I do skincare. This is what I love to do on the side and it works. I love red onions. And what I learned when I did this recipe is when you add lemon to it, it actually takes the acidity out of the onions. So I was really excited to do that. And here I am doing it. Okay, toasting the pistachios. Not gonna lie, I bought the wrong pistachios. So I was peeling them before, but it didn't take a long time. It just took a few minutes on the stove. Just toast them. They actually taste so much different when you toast them, so it makes a difference to do this step and then kind of let it cool on the side. Now it's time to cut the peaches. This is my best method of cutting it, but this is what I know. If you want to send me a note and tell me in the comments a better way so I'm not wasting so much, I'd love to hear it. But to me, this was the cleanest and easiest way to do it into chunks. And we used a white peach, but you can use whatever peach you want. It was really, really sweet, so it took the salad to the next level. And then you add honey to the peaches because goat cheese and honey, if you know, you know, mix it all together. Okay, now you wanna slice up your tomatoes. This is how I like to slice them because I want like a tomato in every bite, but you can cut them in half. You can chop them up any way you want. There's really no wrong way to cut a tomato as long as it gets into your salad. How nice they look and they're so red. Okay, now we're adding our olive oil. Then I'm adding my white vinegar, mixing that in really, really well. And then you add your greens. This is such a refreshing salad for summer. I really recommend it and it's super filling. Okay, and the best part of our salad is the goat cheese. Can't miss that. I hope you enjoy.